Do you ever wonder what happens when the police leave? Crime scene cleaners are private companies that handle the cleanup after the police are gone. Spalding Decon is one of the nation's largest cleanup companies handling the aftermath of homicides, suicides, decompositions, hoarding, and much more. These are our stories. In August, we, my older sons, got a phone call that their father had passed away. We have a decomp. He was here three days, but there's no AC installed. It's just sad. So, we are here in Orlando with Janice. She is going to explain a little bit of the situation. This is not our first time meeting, and we have stayed in contact since the last time. In August, we, my older sons, got a phone call that their father had passed away, unattended, um, in the home that Gary and I had built in 1991-92. We have a decomp. He was here three days, but there's no AC installed, and the windows and door has been open because the police had to kick the door down. So it's just been free game. Went on a Google search, and with a lot of prayer, Spalding came up first. I just called the number that was there, and it was Kyle's personal phone number. It was. <laughs> Actually, it was like 9 or 10 o'clock at night. <laughs> and I was sobbing. And he brought me down and just really helped me calm through the situation. And you guys came out within just a few days. Yeah. And helped to take care of the situation inside the house, which we're still not over. You know, once the build back is done, we'll, right. we'll feel a little of bit course. better. But to know that we didn't just have your support at that moment we i, I feel like you guys have become family of course Between that's what yeah talking to cheryl and talking to you and um, oh, she just gave me goosebumps i'm sorry it's not very nice you, <laughs> i'm getting bitten up by mosquitoes so goosebumps are <laughs> that's nothing. exactly what's happening i'm just allergies <laughs> allergy goosebumps so our goal today is to do the living room first okay the foyer and the master bedroom um and the two bathrooms. And the two or bathrooms. are we going to be able to do all of it in one day? You got that. <laughs> you got the power team here. We got you. I guess so. Um, so yeah, that's the goal today. So I have Mountain Dew that Nick brought. So if you want some caffeine, I've got Coke. Oh, like Coca Cola. Oh, Coca Cola. Okay. Okay. Coca Cola. Coca Cola. Um, <laughs> you know, if you ever need a hug, just say Kyle. <laughs> and I'll come and give you a hug. And then we do the, the <laughs> we live do. long and Oh prosper. yeah, the live long and prosper. Yep. Yeah. yeah, we'll work our way this way. Then we'll be able to get the two couches, the table staying, the dog kennel we'll check on. It's At this point, it's obvious garbage. Okay. So we're actually going to recycle the cans that way. That's why they're all going in one bag here. Knee deep in beer cans. Not how I expect to spend my Friday, but it's where I'm at. It's a nice house. I love the layout. I've heard something about Just a little much away. beer for me. It's just sad. Couches are going, office chair is going, both of those guys. Any of the antiques are staying. She's gonna clean and keep those. Um, we've been working for 10 minutes and we've got uh, a third of the way of the beer cans. So, kicking ass today. So, I absolutely love Janice. Um, she's one of my one of my favorite clients. So, at the drop of a dime, anything that she needs, we'll take care of. So I was like trying to lift it up over, and I was like, <laughs> I'm a little person. Especially when the edge of the truck is like here. Well, yeah, I had to stand on my tippy toes. Because I know for me, when I'm trying to go over it, it's like up to here. And yeah, so I'm like <laughs> vertically challenged. I was born this way. Hashtag. Good job, Nick. No keys. You're the man. Sorry, I'm just trying to catch my breath. What? I'm just trying to catch my breath. Let's do this, muffin top. My love, my love for music. I cannot 
with good fortune. Throw these away. Is it a snake? No, it's silverfish. Uh, they're everywhere. You gonna hold this so I can get out there? Absolutely. Not. Absolutely not. We gotta straighten it up a little bit. There you go. He's so silly. I said you low-key get mad at me when I get in the way of you having fun with destruction. Yeah, I really do. I'm like whatever, he's 21. How am I doing? I'm doing good. Doing good. My antipsychotics are working great. Mine too. We've already went through one box of bags. I think it's right on 12 at this point. We've got 985% of the room, the living room cleared. Um, slowly going at it. Just keep chipping away, I guess. Dancing with a stranger. Let's get ready to rumble! Da -da 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 -da. No? Alright. <laughs> Did you catch me while I was thinking? Taking a quick break. We've been here for three, three hours. So we actually had to stop and take a couple of water breaks. With Within those three hours we've got the living room done. We're getting ready to move into the bedroom and the two bathrooms. And uh, then we'll go through and we'll tear up the carpet load her all up and drive back so we're, we're home by 6, 6.30. What do you want me to say? 85% <laughs> done with the whole thing? Or... Are you smoking crack? Uh, I don't know, or what'd like you give me? percent done. <laughs> if I'm like super weird about antiques and stuff like that, as you all know. And so me trying to get them off the table, I'm like, putting pressure with a battery, but not enough pressure to scratch the wood just to take that off. Because I'm like, even though this is an antique and it's absolutely stunning, I'm like, I'm not gonna scratch it. Yeah, 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 we got this, yeah. <laughs> I'm doing great, how are you doing? I can only see your butt right now, can you angle yourself? Is my butt pretty? Is that my butt? Flat booty Judy. What kind of angle do you want? Coming down the hallway. All right, all right. Um, oops, I put myself in a corner. I just, when, when it's big stuff involved, I've learned that I actually aggravate Nick trying to help. So I just let him do his thing. Absolutely crazy. Like five minutes ago when I came in here, everything was stacked, you know, two foot high. The closet was horrible. I just finished clearing that out. There was like a foot and a half of stuff in the bathtub. For this bathroom, I'm actually going to go and tackle the other bathroom. And I'll probably take a quick water break because the bathrooms have no no airflow at all and holy crap i look like i look death like death myself so six construction bags later it's going starting to clear out the bedroom now we got this left that dresser final cabinet staying and i think that dresser as well and then clean up Really? So it's going pretty quick. Hey Kyle, can you uh, help me out real quick? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you scoot it back? Yeah. How far you need? Uh, nope, 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 nope. It went up on the pile. Oh. I didn't even have a chance to say. Did you grab that? Yeah. You I, thought you, I thought you hit the fan. Give me a second to restuff it so the door will close. You need me to scratch it for you? No. I got you, homie. Yeah. Let's do that. Slow and steady. Beautiful, Nick. Beautiful. I try to be. Thanks, Kyle. So while I was cleaning the bathroom, I found uh, a sink full of his hair from shaving. So all I'm trying to do 
so she doesn't like as we're going through the walkthrough and things like that she doesn't see it and kind of have an emotional breakdown i would never ever ever want someone to go through that and relive it even though it's almost a year later because a lot of this stuff is like empty cardboard boxes and and clothing and stuff like that and there's nothing to keep in here uh, we're clearing i cleared all the stuff off of this edge and then pop the carpet and Nick is clearing off the stuff from that edge and we're actually just going to try to roll all of this stuff into the carpet and then slide it slide it through the window i've never done it uh it was kind of a crazy suggestion of mine and nick was like uh yeah duh we're gonna give it a shot and uh see if we can save some garbage bags and see if we can save a little bit of back uh back pain from the shoveling oh. biggest hoard burrito ever now the rest of that is going to compress this airflow definitely needed Oh, falling. You got it? I'm wondering if the hallway would be the better option. Yeah, hallway's gonna definitely be the better option because that's not going through the window. There we go. Exactly. Shoveling some thigh with my super hot pink boot. <laughs> I'll get the like, white glow stick showing. Yes, my glow stick thigh edge. Okay. So. All right, sunshine, you ready? Once I start going... I'm just kidding. That's gross. <laughs> <laughs> Ready? Yep. Oh my god, we had a dolly there? What'd you get? Rug burn. No. Dolly edge. <laughs> oh shit, are you alright? Yeah, it didn't hurt. So the analogy that we got, we just got was, if your burrito is too full, take some of it out and make a second burrito. We have the padding down here to make another hoarder burrito, so we overstuff because, you know, I love Chipotle and how they, you know, overstuff everything, but uh, it didn't work here. So now we just emptied half the contents, thinned our burrito out. Hold on. We're caught here. I did it. So this, this is what happens when we try to take a shortcut. It never ends up well ever ends well. I should never have suggested it. Oh, Nick, we did it. Oh, give me a second. I'm sorry, that was the easiest way for us to cool down was standing in the rain. No regrets. Yes, yes, yes. So close. So close. Ow. You got all that? Uh, shoes are mine, Home Depot bucket. I'm I just don't want you to trip over it. You're hung up on a fan. You're not going to go anywhere. One, two, three, three. Oh. Probably my short time. Yeah, bring me cans so I can just uh, look like a strong man. <sighs> that was a lot of work. Uh, and I'm over here with one hand. So close, I'm so short. We're going down. We're going to Sock will let go. Gross. Alright, so we are finished. We're all done. I'm Miss. squishy. My feet, my little feet are squishy from the sweat and water and rain. I um, appreciate all the hard work. But totally. We have completely transformed and done exactly what. You asked. What I asked. A hundred percent. And we will finish the rest. So there, the majority of it's gone. So here's the living room. We cut around the furnishings. 
gave you a clean slate to kind of start with. Mm -hmm. And then we'll walk down the hallway. Completely cleaned out underneath there is where we had found that rock that I had previously mm -hmm. talked to you about. The uh, linen closet is completely cleaned out as well. Oh, wow. So um, there's just a few things in there, like some rubber duckies I left for you. Oh, thank you. Um, Memories. So that way, it was just kids toys. And I was like, these are really cute. I'm going to stick them in here. Okay. That works. Then we're going to come in here. This was the master on suite. It still technically is. Yes. But it gives you a chance to absolutely start from scratch. I know you were complaining of the, the linens on the window. So we took them down for you so you can start over there. <laughs> and if you want to take a walk into the bathroom. You, you got this junk out of the shower? I yeah. I got I, um, a lot of just random stuff. Oh dear lord, my ever Yes, yeah, so it can come clean. It can come clean. So your tub and tie shower is totally cleanable. I mean, possibly regrout, reseal. Mm -hmm. I would definitely do a do a new vanity. Yeah. Um, it took you all day to do two hours. and a half rooms. Yeah. My word. Yeah. It's bad. And yeah. it's not bad anymore. Not at all. It's, 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 look, it's manageable. Yeah. Hey guys, thanks for watching. And don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Pause for the cause. And for ring that bell to get notifications locations. when we launch our new episodes every Thursday. Have a good day, guys. Peace. That's it guys, on to the next.